Sergeant Zanella Zachary. Zanella, Z-A-N-E-L-L-A-Z-A-C-H-A-R-Y. Platoon Sergeant, 2nd TSB, LS Company, LS Platoon. So today we were, coming, uh, we were doing a trap mission, tactical recovery of aircraft and personnel. Uh, instead of aircraft, we were recovering an asset. My Marines were getting inserted into LZ Albatross by HMH 464 and then doing a quick rig of a Humvee to get it out of zone as fast as possible. I mean, first off, obviously you need good weather so that the squadron can do what they got to do. Um, being able to do your PCCs and PCIs with the Marines, I mean, we're not grunts, obviously, but being able for them to know how to set up a security on an LZ so that we can control the LZ and then set up the rig without like imminent danger if this was a deployed zone. I mean, it's windy. The hook on the 53, it's gonna be swinging a lot more. Um, our Marines are trained not to chase it. They need to be able to stay calm and under pre stay calm under pressure so that they can get the job done so that they can successfully rig this up and get it out of the area. Overall, a lot of times we like to do uh, practice lifts with the squadrons, doing I-beams or cinder blocks. But I mean, in the end, when you're deployed, that's not what you're lifting. You're lifting real life assets that the Marine Corps owns like Humvees, quad cons, and generators. So being able to lift this type of stuff more frequently, but also doing it in a quick manner, kind of creates a real scenario that we would have if we were deployed. I mean, a lot of times we'll do dry runs at our own shop. We'll go through practicing how to do rigs on Humvees, on UTVs and quad cons, just so that they get, they get a sense of, hey, there's a lot of pressure when you're trying to rig this stuff quickly. And you gotta be able to practice this. Practice makes perfect, right? So the more we do it at our shop, the more we do it in like the PT field behind our office, the better they're gonna be able to perform out here. I think they performed really well. Obviously, there are a lot of things that happened that kind of made it go a little differently, but for them to stay composed and be able to do what they needed to do under pressure, I couldn't have been happier as a platoon sergeant. For this, this exercise today, we used 16 Marines. We had three security elements and one helicopter support team actually doing the rig. Helicopter support team is four. You're gonna have the hook men of safety and two leg men.